Yo, 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 everybody, what's going on? It is Lotus here, back with another Zombie Survivors episode. We are jumping right back into this. We're going to see what we can make happen today. Um, Let's see. I didn't get to look before we started here, but it does look like we are going to probably run... I think we're going to run the Huntress. We're going to run her right out the gate. See if we can make something happen with her. If we get 9,000 to get her unlocked, that'd be pretty sweet. But uh, we'll see. We'll see. We shall see. Um, I am going to take Engineer, though. And uh, maybe we could take SWAT, just to show off if you guys did not uh, see how his turret is. I mean, it's it's a turret, so it's basically exactly what it sounds like. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, we can we can do that. Um, I was really leaning towards potentially taking, um, uh, whatchamacallit, Ghost, but I was like, if I take Ghost and SWAT, like, we're not going to have the Engineer, even though the Engineer is, like, the strong, one of the strongest characters with his, uh, with his shield, so we're definitely going to, definitely going to take him, and then... Our third is going to have to be SWAT, just for the turrets. I was going to take, I, I would like to take Ghost, but um, we just don't have the amount of space to be able to take him. And I mean, like, taking him over Engineer is, uh, it's, it's debatable. I mean, they're both pretty strong. I don't know how long we'd be able to last with Ghost, though, because, you know, his, which his uh, thousand cuts only lasts for so long. So like, I don't know. It's not really worth it in my opinion. I think uh, running engineer is better because it, we have the shield, which basically stuns all these zombies, and that's just like a better off. Like we're just better off going with that. Hopefully we can hit nine thousand though in a in a timely manner because I I am recording this at like three in the morning. On the day that it's supposed to be uh, uploaded. So, well, yeah, hopefully we can get this taken care of. <laughs> and uh, get the show on the road. Because I uh, waited till last minute. Um, but anyways, we are melting the boss, which is pretty cool. I didn't think we were that strong. But then again, we do have a, quite a bit of meta progression. So, I mean, that's sort of expected, I guess. Um, freezing arrow or explosive arrows? Oh... I'm going to go... I mean, we're going to have, what? Engineer, and then SWAT. I'm going to go Freezing Arrows. Freezing Arrows. Freezing Arrows. Just as a... Uh, almost a... Like a defensive maneuver. Take Freezing Arrows as like a defensive option. Because like we're not going to really have... I mean, we will have the Engineer. So, I mean, I guess it doesn't make much sense to do this. Definitely going weapon damage. I think I would definitely like skill cooldown and stuff though, because that would have been pretty sweet. Um, since we will have, you already know it, SWAT and um, the engineer. So like with them two, we're gonna have the turrets dropping. We are able to get so with engineer with with pretty high um, with pretty high uh, skill cooldown. We were able to get, I think, what what was it, like five turrets down at a time, which was pretty insane. So that's definitely the way to go if we can uh, if we can get that going. So hopefully hopefully we can. Um, so far we're doing pretty dang good in my opinion. Um, let's see, yeah, here we go. Let's get the turret. Basically, the turret is exactly what it sounds like. He'll plop down a turret and it'll do damage, like just like that. That's that's all the turret is. <laughs> that's all the turret is. So hopefully we can make some pretty good progress there. Um, I'm gonna take arrow rank because we need we need some more skills rather than just uh, the guns to hopefully clear clear some of this up because it's definitely uh, definitely being a little bit of an issue. I don't think we're gonna run sniper this time because um, I, it's just like yeah I don't think it's the smart way to go. I think the smart way is to go with the uh, the machine gun. 
or not the machine gun, but the uh, assault rifle. I think going the assault rifle will definitely help us out a good bit. Um, let's see, fire rate, movement speed, skill cooldown, weapon related. To that. Yeah, I'll take solar panel. Um, so I think that's the, our best way to go is to take uh, the assault rifle because the machine gun, like, we could take the or not the machine gun, we could take the uh, sniper rifle, but you gotta uh, like remember that like you only get three shots with the sniper rifle, so it's gonna slow down uh, quite a bit. So. Even with reload speed, I don't think the sniper rifle... I mean, the sniper rifle is pretty good against bosses. Like, you gotta give it that. But I don't think it's worth... I don't think it's worth taking if it, if we're gonna run into uh, problems with that. So, we're gonna hold off until the engineer pops up. Hopefully, it'll pop up in the next one. Um, not quite sure on that, though. But hopefully, it will. Take this guy, melt the crap out of this boss, and then pick up the big, uh, big old red gem there. And we got a couple more here. Uh, might as well keep up, upgrading uh, Eagle Eye. Not going to worry too much about... Holy crap, look at all this money. The uh, SMG and stuff. Not going to wor worry about it at the moment. So we'll see. If we get a money upgrade early, that'd be pretty sweet too. Cause, like, or even a flipping... Uh, or flipping... Uh, whatchamacallit drop? Magnet? Magnet would be pretty sick right about now, because there's a lot of XP laying about. That would definitely help us, uh... A lot of XP and money. I mean, money would give us skills, but the XP would definitely boost us up, like, five levels. Which would be super sweet. So let's take this guy and see, hopefully we can get something good out of it. Chocolate box, increase armor by 70%. No, no, no. Reroll, skill damage? Yes. I'll take skill damage. Because, like, the more skill damage we have, like, the better our turret, the more damage our turrets will do, which will be absolutely insane. It'll be pretty sweet. Um, and then, of course, getting, uh, if we can get skill, skill cooldown, that would be just a huge lifesaver as well. And hopefully, hopefully it'll pay off. Hopefully it will pay off. Let's see, though. Let's see. Ghost Engineer. There our boy is. Now, hopefully we can get uh, some level ups to really start pushing uh, pushing this stuff along. I know last time... Oh, energy shield right off the bat, huh? Last time it took uh, a while to max everything out. It took us like 20 minutes. I want to try and max everything out quicker than that. So hopefully hopefully we can. Um, I wonder if pushing for the bosses is like the best way to go. I don't know if that is. Holy crap, the energy shield just like wiped out all of the flipping... It just wiped out that entire boss's, like, wave of, like, bats or whatever it was. Mosquitoes, something. That was pretty insane. Oh my gosh, the energy shield just melted the boss, too. Like, holy smokes, dude. That's insane. The energy shield, like... And I, I feel like I praise it way too much, but holy smokes, man. That was insane. All right. So it sounded like another turret went down. Crit damage, weapon fire rate, weapon damage, weapon fire rate, move speed. I think I'm going to take move speed. Although the boxing gloves did seem very nice. Um, we'll have to take that another time. I want to try and see if we can... I wonder if we should take XP early. Assault rifle, perfect. But I don't think taking XP is going to make much of a difference for us. I mean, it'll help us to get maxed sooner. I mean, it'd give us more money for more levels, so may maybe we should take XP in uh, in this mode. That might be our best bet. I mean, flip, we freaking melt the crap out of, uh, out of bosses with the energy shield, so I'm not really too worried about them. Um, I definitely still need to upgrade Taser. Try and get that. I think we're going to take Laser with that. We're going to take laser and we should be okay. We should be okay. I don't, I don't see us taking too much of an issue off of that. Um, so we're already after 2,000 kills, which is pretty good. We need 9,000, though. I want to try and get the 13,000, though, because if we can get the 13,000, we'll definitely make it for, uh, we'll definitely make it for, um, enough for the medic 
I don't want to have to do like a random medic run in the middle. So hopefully we can. Like, I don't want to do two medic runs, you know? I mean, I could do one in between episodes, get like three or four thousand kills with her. So then, like, in the next episode, we only need to get like nine thousand or eight thousand or whatever. But I don't, I don't want to have to do that. I want to, I want to just keep pressing on for y'all. Weapon fire rate? Yes, please. I'll take weapon higher weapon fire rate. Because that means, like, uh, we'll just shoot faster, which will be insane. And then we basically just need reload speed. I still want to do a run to try and max out. Basically, this might be like a... I mean, we already sort of did a skill cooldown run. Where the energy shield was up the entire time. So, like, maybe we should try and go for, like, a, a full-on... Um, a full-on, like, weapon fire rate run and reload like just go all in and just really try and pound out some stuff this should level us up a good bit okay we didn't level up at all so all the xp must have like expired or something it's been a bummer definitely take the assault rifle try and uh, get this out the way uh, we're gonna run over here and we're starting to not do i mean we're still killing the bosses pretty quick but you can definitely tell that it's starting to slow down so we definitely need skill damage to increase, uh, like, drastically. Because, like, if not, it's going to be a, <laughs> it's gonna be a big issue. So hopefully we can uh, definitely fix that here soon. Try and get to uh, 9,000 kills ASAP. Actually, it'll probably be closer to 10 because I think we need, like, 98.33. So it'll probably be, like, 10.2 probably, most likely. Um, crit damage I'll definitely take. Because uh, we definitely need to figure out the damage. I mean, we also have the crit with uh, our girl here. So I'm not too, too worried about her. Um, I mean, she's, she's not doing half bad. She ain't doing half bad. I need... Okay, we melted him pretty quick. I was like, I need my energy shield to come up. But we just pretty much destroyed him. So I'm not really too worried about that. Um... Hmm. I wish we could get it to scale up a little quicker, cause like, I need levels, I need, I need kills, like I need, I need stuff. <laughs> and right now we're not, uh, we're not getting it as quickly as I would like. Like the levels are, like, come on, man, speed it up, speed it up, give us more, give us more. I mean, we're already, what, 12 minutes in? No, or 9 minutes in, 12 minutes in the episode, so... I mean, we're making okay progress, I guess. But we have, like, another 20 minutes to go, which is a bit of a shame, bit of a shame. Unless, like, we can get more kills quicker, uh, I'd be okay with ending early. I just want to get as much kills as possible early, you know? Because I don't like these super long episodes. Like, I want to... Uh, I want to try and keep them short, but we're at the point where, like, unfortunately, we can't really keep them short. <laughs> Sadly, so. Here we are. Pressing on, baby. Pressing on. Hopefully you guys have been enjoying the content, though. I, I really have been enjoying this game. Hopefully they do a big update here soon. That'd be pretty sweet. Add new characters or something. Or the, uh, fourth tier level of the, uh, of the skill, which would be pretty cool. Or the, not, not fourth skill level of the skill, the, the fourth tier level of the, uh, each character, that'd be pretty sweet. Although you'd probably have to get like a million flipping kills or like a hundred thousand kills or something, but. Oh well. Or like it'd be cool if they added, uh, add something else. I mean, let me know down in the comments what you guys, uh, would like to see added to the game. If you guys have been playing it. Also, if you are new to the channel, welcome, welcome. Um, if you guys have been enjoying, make sure you guys tap that subscribe button. I'm trying to hit a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. And uh, yeah, if you guys like the uh, the content, definitely uh, tap the like button as well. Helps get recommended to other people who may be also enjoy the, who may also enjoy the content. I should say. And uh, yeah. You guys can also press the bell notification. You know if I want a new video is live. You guys don't want to miss out. Upload every single day. All sorts of content. And you guys definitely don't want to miss out. So, 
I mean, we're approaching 4,000 kills, which is pretty... Even though it's already been 11 minutes, it definitely hasn't felt like it. So he's definitely been doing pretty good, but not as great as I would like. We're at horror level 10, so things are going to start spicing up. Spicing up. Stuff's going to start getting a little spicy here soon, so we might as well take this guy. Um, keep the weapon damage going. Um, I would like to see skill damage, though, pop up, but that's okay. If it doesn't, um, we're still doing we're still doing good. Um, I just need more level ups, I think, more than anything. If I, the more level ups, the better. So if we can just keep getting more of that, we'll be looking uh, we'll be looking pretty good. Just keep running toward the bosses, wiping them out. I mean, it's not really giving us anything crazy here because we're still not leveling up as quickly as I would like. But hey, that's okay. We're not really getting uh, any uh, luck drops or money drops. Or not in the supply crates. We're not getting any luck, uh, money, or XP, which is a bit of a bummer. I would definitely like uh, one of those. But uh, we'll see. We'll see. Hopefully we can level up here. And get... Uh, I, see, I don't think I would mind the Tesla, but I also don't really want... The Tesla right now. I mean, we're doing pretty good, to say the least. Um, yeah, we'll keep going with electrocution. Try and get that leveled up a good bit. I should probably should look at getting the grenades as well. Um, I don't know though. We'll see. We'll see. So far, so good. Ah, there we go. There's another supply crate. It's about time. Been waiting for you. What do you have for us? Ah, more skill damage, I see. I'll definitely take that. Just what I'm looking for. Bing! Gone. I mean, especially once we get the two turrets. Like, we'll have the uh, turret from the SWAT. We'll have the turret from uh, the engineer. And shoot, we might be able to do, uh, do pretty good. Do pretty dang good. All right. Let's see here. Not doing too shabby. Um, let's see. Yeah, we'll max you out to get you to stop popping up. Get some other stuff popping up now. Um, let's see. I need to take grenades, and I need to take, uh, what was the other one? Um, there's another one I need to take from him. Oh, the helicopter. So I can take both of them. And then we'll see, uh. See where it leads us. I'm going to run all the way over here. I'm going to pick up uh, the next upgrade. Hopefully it's something good. Ah, perfect. I'll take the last energy shield as well, so that'll stop popping up. And then uh, next will probably either be the energy turret or something else. Hopefully we can max out the huntress as well, because then we can rock uh, the ghost as the main guy in the next one, which will be pretty sweet. And then uh, after that... We can, oh yeah, luck baby. Oh, but money modifier, but luck is better because we'll get more money drops. Um, because if we can max the huntress out this this round, um, we'll get uh, we'll be able to run ghost as the leader in the next one. And then after running ghost as the leader, we can run the medic and show off ghost. And then we'll do one run after that with uh, somebody just to see how long we can make it. And uh, also showcase out the medic's uh, the medic's ability and see uh, see what her third ability is since I, we haven't seen it yet. Um, try and knock that out, and then uh, yeah, we'll try and clean up uh, after after we basically finish all these episodes up. There's a couple other uh, things we need to finish with uh, Choo Choo Survivor. If you guys haven't been watching that, that's been a, that's like another bullet uh, bullet hell bullet heaven, an interesting one with trains. Which is pretty cool, where zombies come after you. So it's 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 an interesting one, um, but we got a few episodes left with that one. Trying to figure out how to get uh, survive 35 minutes because uh, some of the things that we already did didn't work. I don't know if it's a bug or if it's intended, where we actually have to survive 35 minutes in that game. But it's <laughs> it's definitely a lot harder than this one to uh, survive 35 minutes. Um, but we'll we'll have to see. I'm not 100 percent sure on that and then um after that uh farm keeper holy smokes if you guys didn't see the last episode that one was uh 
a little bit crazy as well. That one was um, a lot harder than expected also. Um, a frying pan might be a good one to take, but I'm going to try and max out Axe. Like, if we're, if ones pop up that we already have, I'm going to just take it just to try and uh, basically try and max out the, uh, the passive skills, like, the best I can. Um, so we'll see there. Because, like, the more I can max that out, like, the better. And then, like, we'll get other ones that'll pop up. Rather than getting, like, 75 passive skills popping up, we can just, like, max out the ones that we already have and then, like, get new ones after that. So, so far, so good, though. Um... Definitely need to uh, work on getting uh, some more upgrades. Like, this is taking forever. Like, I understand we're level 46, but shucks, man. Like, come on. Give us some something good here. Give us something good here. It's like, not happening. Alright, let's run down here. Get the next uh, upgrade. Hopefully, uh, something good. Perfect. Yeah, we'll max you out. We'll max you out. And then off to the next one. Run over to the crate. Hopefully it gives us, uh, I don't know, another axe would be cool or a teddy bear. Weapon damage down. Skill cooldown. Yeah, we're taking homing pigeon. Although I definitely would have liked the other one for the XP. But I want the one that gives us either, that gives us 10 XP based off of, uh, based off of like and, and there's no negative effect like the stick there like has the mi minus five percent weapon damage which realistically it probably wouldn't have made a difference for us but i don't want to have to take that one like i'd rather have that one as like a last resort oh <sighs> i'd rather not lose weapon damage because why would i want to get weaker like we're going for power we're going for power! I don't want to get weaker, man. Like, come on, dog. So far, so good. Ooh, we got a red gem there. That's a big baller move. That's a big baller move right there. Alright, yeah, we'll just wipe this guy out real quickly. I mean, it's definitely a lot slower than it was before, so we definitely need to... Definitely need to do something to speed up the, uh... The skill damage. Ah, perfect. Give me the SOS signal. Give me the skills that I need to press on. Um, I guess I'll go with the turret. Um, I mean, it just sucks because like we're still gonna get gun upgrades because that one's not maxed yet, but that's okay. Um, crit damage? Yes, out of all that. Looks like that's the way to go. Laser, yes. I'll definitely take you. And I'm a little bummed I did not get uh, any other uh, levels off of that. That's a real uh, real bummer. Real bummer. I mean, skill upgrade is... Or not skill upgrade. Uh, skill cooldown is at a pretty good rate to where uh, the shield comes up a f couple seconds afterwards. So it's almost up all the time. So we just need uh, skill cooldown like... Probably another 5% and we'll be there, which will be pretty sweet. Another magnet up over here, so we're going to run over here and collect that real quick. Even though there's not much on the ground, it seems. Uh, I'm going to pick up laser again. <sighs> After we get the laser, sorry about that. Um, uh, we get, just need one more and it's max, so we're good there. And then after that, I think it'll be time to just take the helicopter and the grenades for the SWAT guy. And uh, maybe even try and max out the uh, arrow rain. So we'll see there. We'll see there. Ooh, both of them are in the, like almost the same area. And that doesn't happen very often. Um, invisibility. Oh, XP modifier, but the T-Pose. Ah! I'm taking XP. I'm taking XP over T-Pose. Hopefully T-Pose pops up again. 
Hopefully it pops up again. Uh, electric turret again. We can max out electric turret before. That'll be the best. Oh man, they're like right at the same time, which is huge. Which is huge. All right. So we could almost like be blasting just turrets, man. Just be blasting turrets. All right, wiped that out really quick. I mean, the XP upgrade, I'm not seeing too much of a difference right now. That hurt a lot, man. Um, get laser. I should probably definitely be careful on taking hits now at this point. Because these guys are going to hit for like, what was it, 900 was the last one that hit us? Um, not, not this episode, but in the last episode when we died. Hit us for like 900, so I definitely got to be careful on the hits. That's for sure. That's for sure. I definitely need more skill cooldown, though, if I really want to uh, press through this. Alright, I'm going to run over here to this part. Or, like, at least get regen or something. Because, like, we need another 1,500 kills. Like, come on. Can't go down that easily, man. Can't go down that easily. Um, homing pigeon, yes. Like, we could take more damage, but right now it's not going to help us a whole lot. Like, we need we need survivability, so I probably should have took that T-pose, but I definitely didn't. Holy crap, look at all that money. Uh, more grenade trail, yes, definitely. Definitely grenade trail. Um, I feel like that that could definitely help just, just a little, just a little bit, you know? Just a little bit. Um, yep, get arrow rain. Although, if we could get the electric turret up and get it maxed, that would actually probably be a huge flipping help, man. Not gonna lie. That would definitely help a good bit. So let's try and... That'll probably be the next uh, the next thing that we max is the electric turret. Um, that hurt just a, just a tad, you know. Just a tad. That was that was all. Um, come on, we're, it should be about time for our uh, next um, set of crates, right? Should be about it. There's another boss. Oh yeah, definitely taking a while to go down now. If we can get more skill damage, that would be cool. Ah, oh, there's a crate. Um, no SOS beacon though, which is interesting. To say the least. Um, mo money modifier. Oh, weapon reload time could be really good too though. I think I'm going to take money modifier here. Just because like, we're up to 14 already. And like, after... After we max out all the skills, like, all we have left is money. So, like, might as well take it. Uh, arrow rain. Oh, there's electric turret there. I should have took electric turret. Gosh, dang it. Dang it all. Yeah, like, 640. Like, that's huge. Why didn't I take electric turret? Electric turret. Um, electric turret. Arrow rain. I don't even know if that's what it's called. Hitting arrows, something, I don't know. And then after that, it'll probably be grenades and then helicopters last. Helicopter I don't care too too much for. But we'll definitely look at taking it. It does look like we are at the point though where the energy shield is up 24-7, which is sweet. Absolute killer. Um the boss is still hurt a tad, so uh, we gotta be careful on that. We are at the point where we're placing down three turrets at the same time, which is huge. Absolutely baller, man. Absolutely baller. Alright. We still aren't making uh, as much XP as I would like to max this stuff out. Like, it's definitely taking slower. Definitely taking... Definitely being slower than uh, I would have hoped. But we're doing good. Um, let's run all the way over here to this next upgrade. Hopefully we'll level up in the process as well. Nope, not quite yet. Um, definitely taking you. And then we'll level up 
in a minute. Definitely with that, we'll level up. So we'll definitely take electric turret. Uh, nope, no second level. Okay, that's that's pretty cool. That's as uh, that's as expected. All right, sick dog. Dodge chance? Uh, yeah, I'll take you out of all that. I mean, I didn't care for all of them, but uh, dodge chance I'll definitely take because that could help us for uh, survivability sakes. Um, next would probably be Tipos. If that popped up, that would be uh, super useful as well. Um, more money, of course. Money modifier. If I can get that up to uh, plus 30%, that would be, that'd be insane. That would actually be super, super, super useful. Um, but yeah, so far so good. Making good progress. 25 minutes. I, I don't remember the longest we've lasted. I think it was 35. Does it tell us? Um, it does not tell us, but, uh, I think it tells us after the fact, so hopefully we can break the record that we currently have. We just broke 9,000 kills, so I think we need to have, like, a little, a little more to go. Like, I think we need 800 more, but I think we need to go over that because I don't think, uh, she's killed that many quite yet what the hell does kill characters mean I'm not going to press it in, like, in case it kills my characters <laughs> uh, we'll have to check um, after we get the achievement we'll check out what that button means I imagine it means exactly what it means like kill characters so like we die so I, I don't want to try that quite yet I'd rather get the achievement first and then try it um, weapon damage, crit damage, yep, we'll max out the crab. Max out the crab, and then uh, it will go from there. Run all the way down to this guy. Uh, we'll max out you. Next will be the raining arrow. And then uh, helicopter, and we'll be good. Oh, grenades, grenades. Raining arrow, grenades, helicopter. Um, yep, raining arrows, cool. Looking good, looking good, baby. Looking good. All right, money's looking real good, too. We're up to 16 so far. Hopefully, we can get up to, like, 20 by, before, by the time we get the achievement, but I don't I don't think that's going to happen. Um, but that's okay. It's not the end of the world. If we got the uh, early on, uh, every time we got a training point, you got a uh, level up. That would have been pretty sweet because we would have gotten 16 extra levels and everything would have been maxed by now. That's, like, one that you want to get out of, like, the first supply crate, I feel like. Especially since we got the money upgrade. Like, if we got that out of the first supply crate, that would have been huge. But, hey, beggars can't be choosers, am I right? Alright, so far, so good. We're avoiding a lot, which is good. Hey, there she is. 9,700, so we didn't even need 10,000 kills. I think we only needed, like, I think it was 9,300 9, that we needed. So we, we did pretty good. Um, definitely let's go more, uh, oh, this is so tempting. Let's go more money. More money! I mean, we did technically get the achievement, so I'm curious on what that button does. So, let's, uh, just run around just a little more. Okay, before we die. What does this do? Oh, yeah, it literally just kills our characters. Alright, let's not do that quite yet. I mean, we're about to die anyways. Um, but that's okay. That's okay. Hopefully you guys did enjoy We did get the achievement, which is a killer. We absolutely made it. So, yeah, see, we didn't have to do all the kills with her because she only got 2,000. So, But we unlocked it, Bullseye. We unlocked the zombie decoy. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed up to this point so far. We did get six, 20, or we're up to 21 points as well. So we could get two of you. We could max you. Um, or we could upgrade some crit down here. Um, let's do all the lower ones. So you're six, you're six. And then, like, let's see. Do I want uh, reload, crit damage, crit hit, or health regen? I'm going to do... I'm going to go with reload. We go with reload. Because now we got 11, 22... 33, 44, holy smokes, dude. And then 44, 54, uh, 60, 66 at least. 
I mean, then we'll need a lot for these guys down here. But we're almost uh, <laughs> we're almost having the, all the meta progression maxed out, which is massive. But yeah, hopefully you guys did enjoy. If so, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. Don't forget to comment what you guys think. Next episode, we will uh, we'll run the Huntress, show off the decoy. We'll run Ghost as well as the leader to try and get him uh, maxed out. We'll see uh, if we can hit that 11,000 kills in one run. But uh, I'm not sure yet. We'll see. We'll run Ghost, Huntress, and then Engineer, and we'll run like a full crit build since we'll have both of these guys. Um, maybe run a yeah, increase. Maybe we'll run to like a huge dodge build or something. I don't know. But once again, thank you guys all for watching. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you guys tap the like button. If you are new, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and hopefully I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.